With celebrities getting recognized everywhere they go, for some anonymity might be a nice change of pace, and for others a major blow to the ego. Well, I want this when six foot nine LeBron James walked in with a stack of pizzas from the kitchen at Blaze Pizzeria, people were extremely confused because it wouldn't make sense to actually be him. And well, others just straight up had no idea who he was. What's going on, man? How you doing? Sean Mendez was having some alone time at a coffee shop when he was approached to take a video. At first, he said no until he was told it was not actually a video of him. You might know, hold this phone. I'm gonna, uh, I want to do a video for my mom. You just hold it. No, I'm sorry, bro. No, you good? No, I'm sorry. You, you won't be in it. Oh, just for you. Yeah, yeah, just for you. I'm going to record it. It's already going. What? Orlando Bloom is a famous English actor that's been seen in some of the most well-known movies like Lord of the Rings. But apparently Billie Eilish had no idea who he was when Katy Perry introduced him, only to find afterwards from her friends who he was. Guys, that, guy. that was him? Yeah, that's that him. was him? That's right, I'm so skinny. No way! I wouldn't know anything about that. Bring him back. I want to meet him again. A humbling moment for Jennifer Lopez happened when she went to visit her childhood home with a TV crew, expecting to be recognized and get a whole moment out of it. But the man currently living in the house didn't seem too amused. Huh? My name is Jennifer. Jennifer? Yeah, I used to live up, and then my room was upstairs right there. Jennifer Lopez. Who's Jennifer Lopez? Me. I used to live here. When the whole Cleveland Cavaliers had to resort to the NYC subway to get to the arena on time, a commuter wasn't very happy. What's the question? What's the question? I don't know this dude right here. He tripping. <laughs> a biker at a light turned to check the vehicle next to him to see Shia LaBeouf just dead staring at him. How you doing? Good. I got earplugs in, but I'm good one. Despite being in one of the biggest TV shows in history, Amelia Clark somehow tends to blend in with people much more than her co-stars, and even told Conan that she's often the one asked to take the pictures. I'll be walking with Kit Harrington, plays on Snow, or... Gwen or something like that and they will be people will be like oh can you take this picture for us and I'm like sure definitely I can Wait. sure I can I'll go into the like I'll be like Kit just be one minute I'm just gonna go into the loo and then I'll these girls being chat. like chat what is she playing that I remember chat what, what's she playing do you, th you think thinking yeah. like who is that girl that he's with <laughs> hey, it's me. Comedian Jerry Seinfeld is known for being a germaphobe and is not a fan of physical contact with others. So when famous oh, singer Kesher ran up to him asking for a hug, she was turned down, and he didn't know who she was either. Hi, love you so much. Oh, thanks. Can I give you a hug? No, thanks. Please. No, thanks. A little one. Yeah, no thanks. Oh. <laughs> that was a nice moment. I don't know who that was. Yeah, it was Kesha. Okay. That, that is so cringe, so funny. Oh. Adam Sandler took his daughter to the local IHOP on a busy Sunday morning, and the waitress didn't recognize him. So when she told him there was a 40-minute wait, he left. And well, people gave him props for not pulling the celebrity card. And later, IHOP organized a charity all-you-can-drink milkshakes event after finding out what happened. Elle Fanning might have shown some sociopathic tendencies on The Conan Show when she revealed that she likes to make up lives when getting in an Uber. I don't know who I am, and I just find that fascinating. I don't know what happened. So what did happen? The guy, the guy pulled up as a human and walked out as a human. Gotcha. So I go in, I kind of make up careers or like stories to tell the Uber driver, so I totally just like lied to them. Yeah. Yeah, you're a sociopath, I think. Yeah. It's the <laughs> when it comes to celebrity sightseeing, a lift is the last place you'd think of seeing one. That's why a Demi Lovato fan did not recognize her despite already having met her in the past. And her reaction when she found out is hilarious. I actually met Demi Lovato too one time. Was she nice? Yeah, she was super, super, super nice. <gasps> well, it's good to see you again. Yeah, you have a... <gasps> oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! But Demi Lovato wasn't the only one not recognized when driving for Liv, with Shaq being able to catch some people off guard with his costumes. Go free throws. Bridge your fingers out. Guys, who, who's sitting in the front seat, dude? Guys, who takes a lift and takes the front fucking seat, dude? And then follow through, watch your nails. I want you to do your nails, though. You just learn from the greatest free throw coach of all time. When Selena Gomez was being driven to the hotel from the airport, the driver had no idea who she was or why so many people were surrounding her at the airport. And well, during the drive, they had a good conversation and Selena Gomez made a sweet video for the man's daughter. I'm speaking to this amazing man right now and I just wanted to tell you I love you and I hope everything's going well. 
What? Yeah, wait, all of them no, staged it. That sucks. Yeah, I, I, I. You don't know my name. No. Say I, it. Say it. Say Selena. Yes. Selena Gomez. Yeah. No, I'm sorry. <laughs> no, it's epic. I didn't. I didn't want you to know no, my name. No, I name Gomez, man. I, I, I name in my mind Gomez. At Adele's birthday party, she set up a karaoke booth for her guests to show off their singing skills. And Ashton Kutcher happened to be amazed by one of the guests' voice. He does this, like, ABBA song that's, like, so... I, I'm like, oh my god, it's like banana. Mila and I go up to him and we're like, you're a ringer. You're definitely... You're like a karaoke ringer. You're really good. Like, uh, like really good. And he's like, thanks, man. I, thank you. I really appreciate that. So we go to our friend and we go... God, that guy was really good, huh? They're like, it's Harry Styles. A Brazilian tourist in Bulgaria was curious and took a picture with a man who everyone wanted to take pictures with and had many cameras following him. Little did she know it was the president of Bulgaria. Why are you I'm not sorry. Wait, what did you do? Bro, guys, isn't it kind of weird though, people that take pictures with people just because other people think that they're... I always thought it was kind of weird. Maybe I'm dumb though, I don't know. You are important. I'm not so important. Nah, like, people are taking pictures getting... and uh, yeah. uh, you're important. Why? I'm the president. No. <laughs> For the Jimmy Kimmel Show, Jennifer Lawrence was set to surprise fans on Hollywood Boulevard, but instead she found the biggest Jennifer Aniston fan. Five Jennifer Lawrence movies. Five Jennifer Lawrence movies. I know. Uh, who is um, the Silver Linings Playbook, um, um, Hunger Games, Hunger Games, Hunger Games, Hunger Games. Oh, that bitch. Ashley Bonanniston, I could tell you. Right, Jennifer Aniston is way better than Jennifer yeah. Do I win? Do you agree? Yeah, much yeah, better. I love her. Prettier, funnier. Yes. Yeah, yes, better movies. Yes, yes, I yeah. love her. Yeah, overall. Yeah, great. Um, I'm Jennifer Lawrence. Oh. <laughs> Okay, not sure why Floyd Mayweather was in a barber shop to begin with, but a rude woman was annoyed by the amount of attention he was receiving. Jeff, what are they shaving you? And started going after him. I don't know you. I don't know you. I don't know you. So what's the big deal? You got to tell them. I know about the great. Lewis Hamilton is perhaps the most famous driver in Formula One, but for some reason got mad after security didn't recognize him with the helmet on. It's what wets his past to get through Bernie's turnstile to get back into I mean, the Lamb of God's lead singer was pleasant. I mean, bro, could have just been a cosplayer. Chat, guys, guys, there's one thing I, ne I could never get mad at is security. You know why? Because at the end of the day, they work for you uh, on paper, right? Because if that was an intruder and you're an actual driver, that guy could, like, be a killer and shit. That guy could, that, 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 you could have been the killer of you, of you, you know? surprised when security for his own event didn't recognize him. Migos rapper Offset was stopped by the police a few years ago due to having a window tent too dark for the legal limit. He did try to pull the famous card, but sadly for him the police did not recognize him, and he even FaceTimed his lawyer in Cardi B during the whole ordeal. I'm, sir, I'm famous too, so okay, I, I know my rights. You said you're famous, who are you? I'm Offset, Migos. Who's that? <laughs> the Matrix is one of the most successful movies of all time, generating over half a billion in the box office, and it's still quoted in pop culture till this day. Despite this, Keanu Reeves managed to successfully go incognito in public while riding on the subway, and he even gave up his seat to an older woman. I'm running big in. With Taylor Swift swinging her first music publishing deal at the age of 14, she's been in the spotlight ever since she was a kid. So when she visited South Korea and nobody recognized her back in 2011, she said it was a nice change of pace. Reese Witherspoon's reputation took a big blow after official police dash cam footage was released of her husband being arrested over suspected driving under the influence, and she went to confront the police. The actress ended up being arrested for obstruction of justice that night. Yes, In perhaps one of the funniest unrecognized celebrity moments, Enrique Iglesias worked a shift at Astro Burger in West Hollywood and kind of started messing with some of the customers. Why is her friend laughing? <laughs> she went to an all-girls school, I don't know what she 
<laughs> but things quickly went downhill when fellow celebrity Amy Smart went into the store. And even though Enrique Iglesias did recognize her, she didn't and didn't appreciate his sense of humor. You are famous. That's cool. Would you ever go out with a guy that flips burgers? Yeah, but I have boyfriends now. Does he flip burgers? No. How long have you been dating? Off and on, 10 years. 10 years? Off and on? Veggie burger with cheese. Uh, don't get mad. Your burger. I'll give you a pro Trust me, you'll be thanking me years from now. No, he's not. You should give him what he wants. It doesn't matter. I don't know. Just relax. I need an ass. I'm not. You're harassing everybody in here. What do you mean I'm harassing? Just, he needs a protein burger. When Lil Uzi Vert was going to make a surprise appearance at Gunna's concert, security did not recognize him and turned into a scuffle. That's, that's a double. Surprisingly, when Kendall and Kylie Jenner went through the drive through at In-N-Out, either they weren't recognized or the employees decided to not make a fuss about it. Bread and grilled onions, please. And wow, same thing for me. Okay, so should we just sit in the, the thing and eat? Former NFL star Adrian Peterson was asked by a reporter his opinion about road rage without knowing who he was. Yeah, that, that was literally a useless slip. What the fuck? Bro, not every person is supposed to do something. Wait, the there? reaction to the reporter when he finds out is priceless. Your name? Adrian Peterson. Hi. Yeah. <laughs> Wait a minute. You're not. Uh... Yeah. <gasps> <laughs> Ed O'Neill's daughter jaw dropped when he sent her a picture asking who the woman in the picture is because he knew that she was famous but couldn't figure out who it was. I, I desperately need to know a name so that when I, I couldn't even say the name, you know, yeah. it's wonderful to meet you. And so I don't know if you have the picture. Yeah. That was a weird video. I mean, so some were kind of like insightful, some were kind of dumb. So I don't know. Kind of conflicted about it.